I've been picking flowers in the garden and there was this leaf and when I brought the flowers in and I put this leaf down I thought that looks a bit odd and looking closer at it this is something that looks just like a twig attached to the leaf but it isn't a twig it's a creature and it's got legs that are attached to the leaf at the base and that's its head and it's just look it's got little legs at the front and it's got little legs at the back <laughs> and it's exactly like a twig and it's got little feet that are attached to the leaf and it's just incredible I never knew there was anything like this in England and this was in our garden just attached to this leaf it's some kind of um it's not a caterpillar I'm going to put it near the light Oh, look at that. Now it's walking along the leaf. It's been motionless for a long time. But it's actually um, got a head at the top and little legs and feet at the bottom that are gripping tightly onto this leaf. But it's a living creature. I wouldn't know whether it's an insect or an animal or what it is. It's even got a lump on its back to look like the knot of the wood. That's its little head. Well, it's probably got six legs. It looks like it's got four at the front. Well, much to my amazement, David says this is a stick insect. I didn't know we had stick insects in this country. And I've lived to the grand old age of 60. And I've just found my first stick insect in our own back garden. So I'm going to take him back outside and put him back where I found him in case he's got a Mrs. Stick Insect out there as well. <laughs>